I really want to take coding to like the next level. I want to be fluent, if that's the right word to use, in many programming languages. I think I can really make an impact in helping other communities. And since it's such a new career almost, coding, like my dad didn't know coding existed until I did Bridge Up. In Bridge Up STEM at Georgia Tech, High school girls and gender non-conforming students learn computing skills and they experience firsthand what it takes to be a computing researcher. The program is a partnership between the National Center for Women in Information Technology, Georgia Tech's College of Computing, and our funder, the Helen Gurley Brown Foundation. The partnership basically acts like a bridge where it has students in at each level from high school, undergraduate, graduate, and then finally up to faculty working together, kind of bringing each other up to the next level. Our high school participants are called Bridge Up STEM Scholars and they immerse themselves in a summer coding class at Georgia Tech. They then participate in a nine month research internship working with Georgia Tech computing faculty and undergraduate mentors called Helen Fellows. Anyone can have that idea about you know, the dauntingness of computer science. In my opinion, it is a lot easier to get into. You just need to de demystify it. It was different than I expected because I thought I was going to be stuck in a computer lab all day. Which, not really because I get to work with the actual robots and right now with our project that we're making, it's a lot more hands-on than I thought. There's a bunch of reasons to get women in STEM, but I would say for me, the reason why I'm most focused on it is because I actually think that we're not developing technology for the broad range of people in our world if we don't have all sorts of different people participating in that development. When you have different people at the table, even if you are not that person who is from the underrepresented group, you think about things from their perspective. So there's a lot of evidence that shows that if we can increase the diversity in technology, we will actually increase the creativity and the innovation amongst everybody at the table. We hope that both our high school students and college participants walk away with an enhanced sense of belonging, confidence, and resilience that will lead them to careers in computing research.